Got no power. Oh no, what's he done? <laughs> Welcome to Reactive Terrain. So I figured you guys really enjoyed our mud mayhem. So we thought we'd do it again, but with a little difference. And uh, I don't know what he's doing. He never knows what he's doing. Oh, he's brought the wrecker in. That's what he did. He just brought his wrecker in. Put the wreckers around the course. Did mud blocking. He needs trucks to pull them out, don't we? So let's have a little quick look at the course. So, this is the pit, the mud pit, and this, ladies and gentlemen, is my barn find mud bogger. I've uh, got a custom built brass chassis under there, hand built body, little utility back, bit of a bird's nest, I don't know what that is, a moonshine crate maybe. Little headers and exhaust sticking out using the uh, FMS wheels. What are you doing over there? Nothing. I'm not doing nothing. What are you doing, G Dog? I'm just putting my handset together. But that's what. What are you putting? What are you using for mud bogging then? Well, you said I got to up my game. I did, yeah. So I've upped my game. You're gonna take. Your brand spanking new shiny six wheeler through the mud. Yeah. All right. Let's do this. <laughs> so the rules are simple. Okay. Start and finish. Where's the middle? There isn't one. It's the mud. Just wet. It's just mud. Wet mud. The mud is the middle. We're gonna finish at this end, just where the uh, shiny new atlas is. It's not going to be shiny for long, is it? No. <laughs> um, time trial run. Going to start at the base of Miner's Mound. Going to come all the way along. Through the bog. Past the abandoned truck. Past Joe's bait and tackle. To the end. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And we're going to get muddy. Now, hopefully you're not going to blow up your ESC again. Well, I mean, come on. If I blow this up, then I might as well go home. Well, you know, you 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 did you did burn out your ESC last time. I did. So let's see. I put mine quite high. I've got my battery quite high, so it's a little top heavy. And I'm running the new kind of 370 upgrade motor in it as well. The big that's gearbox. A big motor it's in a there. big motor in I mean, there. That's why I've had to go for six yeah. wheels. I haven't got a 3S in it yet, but I have got a 3S system coming for it. Yes, because I want to flick mud everywhere. I just want to flick mud everywhere in this mudder. So, um, oh, let's, let's talk it. Let's get on with it. Let's go. Barn find mud bogger. Oh, it's alive. It works. I've made it really wobbly, so it kind of, uh, bits might even fall off of it. Look at it. Yeah. Body roll on it. Hey, look at the exhaust on it. Yeah. All right. Three. Let's get it. Oh, 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 it's straight in the goo. Oh, oh lovely. dear. Straight in the goo. Off the ramp. He's, he's steaming around it, though. That motor oh, is oh, oh, absolutely... Oh, oh, can I get underneath Ooh. it? Oh. He's there. Oh, well, that was a very exciting, was it, ladies and gentlemen? I mean, like, like seconds. Right, let's... We need to... Although, I'd say it was a very exciting... Let's take a little picture of that side. We're definitely getting muddy. <laughs> <laughs> right. Let's go again. I try not to. Uh... I'm going to try and um, get him going over the rocks this time. Oh, oh, he's got steering, no power. Got no power. Oh no, what's he done? No power, no power to the warp drive, Captain. Has the battery come undone? Uh, no, because I got steering. Okay, all right, repairs. Oh, it's okay, know. ladies and gentlemen. It was a false alarm. It was just the battery was dead. Um, and at the moment, I haven't got a battery holder for it, so it just gets stuffed in the cab. Extra weight on Extra top. Extra weight on top. Right. Are we all ready to get this Atlas Day? G-Dog is. 
Here, in the great outbacks of the barren land, the incredible atlas takes its virgin tail. In yeah. blood. It's, um... Yeah. It's looking nice, isn't it? It's... I, I don't really want to take the camera off it why it's so shiny, but... Then again, this is me. <laughs> oh, he's gone for it. Oh, oh, it's ploughing. Oh, oh I love it. It's chewed up the mud. Just look. No, not right. even dirty. Not even dirty yet. Well, we know what this all works out, though. We have to keep churning through the mud to get it more fun. Go for it. Oh, oh, he's just ploughing it. It's just mullering. Right. Me. I reckon you should go backwards. Go okay. backwards. Backwards? No, <laughs> yeah, go backwards. <laughs> oh, okay. Ready, steady, go. It is just full war in all of this. No problem. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 Oh, oh dear! <laughs> well, it's not really muddy yet, is it? I mean, it's, I mean, it's. I mean, you've definitely broken it in. Yeah. All right. Oh, do you want one more go, and then I'll fire up the barn find again and see yeah, if I can we'll actually. Yeah, just have one more quick go, and then I just want to churn it up a bit for you. Oh, is that what you're doing? Yeah. You're the churn. Ready, go, steady, go. Full bore. Oh, it's getting a little muddier now. There we go. We're seeing a little bit of resistance in the wheels, but it's still ploughing through. Nicely you done. Right. You put all that time and effort into making an engine and then you stick a battery just in the cab. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, oh, just, just tap the screen that goes into focus. Right. And a big yellow. Oh, it's off. Big, I mean, that moment plowing through this. I mean... Okay, well, <laughs> I, I can't even tell you how quick that was. I have to be careful. It it wants to wheelie a little bit, and my body isn't that secure at the moment. Um... Oh, <laughs> wow. oh, that jumps quite high, yeah. Isn't it? Look at that, that motor is whizzing with that new battery. In. Oh, 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 I really should secure my body better. I think, I think I'll do three th magnets on it. I know, I know, but I think, um, yeah. Right, well, it's okay. safe to say, um, <laughs> that's not struggling. <laughs> no. I'm going to find a big rubber band and band up that body so I can start jumping off those rocks. G-Dog has worked something out with Adam. We are going to have a Frankenstein truck again. Frankenstein 3. All the technology in the world, and we still have to use cable ties. Oh, yes. Oh, and I took the back bit off because I really do want to jump this. This. Right. Let's see if we can get some air on this. No, hang on, hang on. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> that, is, that motor is steamy, isn't it? Wow. <laughs> oh, look, mud splatter all over the dog, all over the shack. Just so I get somebody there, though. Oh! Oh! oh, 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 oh I think you're getting worse than me. I think I've definitely, uh, well, it's do, living up to its name. Just quick. I can't keep up. <laughs> Oh, it just ploughs through everything. It just doesn't want to stop. Oh. Right. Well, I mean, come on. This guy's gone from <laughs> meticulous bodywork and everything special to I really don't care. Yeah, well, you know, if, um, <laughs> you know, it's, I mean, it's... What's your excuse for making that now? Um, I wanted to embrace... The redneck culture. <laughs> He's absolutely rude. <laughs>
Well, can you have as much fun at home? Definitely not. No. I mean, it definitely works well as a mud truck. I mean, it does what mud trucks do. It does. It ploughs. It falls over. <laughs> and it gets stuck. And then it ploughs again. Yeah. I think that motor is doing you proud, I got on with it. That motor's definitely packing a punch. Yeah. But um, is it powerful enough to have a tug of war fight <gasps> with the Atlas? Oh, da, da, da. let's do this. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you've seen this before. It is a new version of tug of war. So we've got a slightly newer cord with a little cable tie in the middle. And uh, we've got our middle marker. It's this one here. Left team. Right team, get the marker to the cone. I mean, it's as simple as that. It is. Um, oh, um, okay. excuse me. Right. It gets, it gets you. <laughs> He's got a hump there to... Right, okay. <laughs> All right. In three, two, one. Mud bar! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Yours is heavy, man. I mean, I'm spinning mud, but I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere either. Although I do believe you definitely got a jump on me because it definitely pulled it back. So I will say that's uh, one to the six wheel. Now, if this was smell-o-vision, oh. <laughs> you would be able to smell the mud. <laughs> To say we're on a farm and the mud may have come from local fields. <laughs> All right. In three, two, one. Let's get mud in. Oh, I'm buried down. Right, let's get some action in here. The barn fine is just spinning and spinning. The six oh, wheel is... It's struggling. It's struggling. I mean, I got the power. I just got no traction. I need more weight. I'm not, I'm not barely getting the wheels turning. Oh, oh, have you got... Oh! Right, I've got to give you that one. I think that's, uh... One to the barn find. Okay, do you need a little bit of a time to, uh... I'm not quite sure what's wrong with it. All right, we're going to just, uh, we're going to see what's going on with the, the, uh... Have we broke the Atlas? <laughs> Let's find out. Okay, so the Atlas wasn't broke. It was just... Buried to the axle and just wasn't doing a busting lot. Definitely got the jump on you then. Oh, it definitely, definitely hasn't got the power. I mean, I've got the power. It's just trying to get it. Come on, girl. I mean, I'm dragging it back. <laughs> All right, okay, well. Gonna have to give you that one. Yeah, look at that, ladies and gentlemen. The barn fine beast. <laughs> Definitely Did getting you know a... it. was about 10 times bigger. Well, you've got you know, six, wheels, six, wheels, six wheels, six wheel drive. Just not. Um... Do you want to swap sides? Let's swap sides and uh, see if that makes a difference. Okay. So we've swapped sides to see if that's going to make any difference. Probably not. But at the moment. The barn find mud bugger Two. is definitely taking the lead yeah. over the six wheel drive Atlas Beast. Disappointed. <laughs> okay, in three, two, one, let's get ready. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's got no power. <laughs> I mean, there's just nothing, got going, nothing on. going on. That motor is struggling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's just... <laughs> it's not doing anything. Let me back up. Just give it a go, give it a go. No. I mean, I'm not going to... You're buried so far down in that hill. There's no way. I've got to try and pull you and the no, hill. I'm no. never going to get through that. But I backed up to see if you could... Uh, no, I can't. Of... I'm stuck. That is... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've still got power, Captain. Oh yeah, mud everywhere. Yeah. I've got. I mean, it is. Ladies and gentlemen, watch this for a bit of flick action. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I I think we need to 
redesign the mud bogging. Well, we never thought section. it'd be, uh, you know, as good fun as this. So we never really. I mean, I'm just sinking over the way. <laughs> yeah, you're just... definitely just sinking. All right, I'll give it one more go. Okay. In three, two, one, go. Oh, well, it buries down. It just about. If you get better speed on it, I guess. No, you're not going to pull me out of that because I've just buried myself. So. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, it is getting muddy. And the Let, six Let's by see six. the six will do the same. Oh, yeah, there we go. So, uh, the barn find mud bogger tore the atlas apart. Uh, yeah. But in the atlas's defence, it has the tiniest little motor <laughs> I mean, in it. I mean, come on. It's got I mean, a really, really small kind of micro you can't motor. even you see can't it even like it's it's just you can't you can't it's even it's so it small there. you you can't even see it it's in there you can see down it and the uh barn fine mud bogger has the 370 conversion in it um so it's packing a little bit more punch it's packing a punch that yeah really definitely is. done what i wanted it to do i wanted a mud bogger that that kind of lit up, hit the you know, hit the ramp and flew into the pit, and it does exactly that. And, ladies and gentlemen, I think I found the perfect use for the Power Wagon FMS wheels. Build a mud bogger, because they work brilliantly. Yeah, yeah. However, G Dog did say, I want to take the big boy through the mud. Sorry, G Dog. I said I'm a little bit disappointed in the Atlas in the in the bog. Oh, I thought dear. he would have done better. He brought it because he thought he was going to destroy his set. Yeah. And but, again, you, uh, look, you did win the wreck around. I did. So you got that on me. Yeah. This time. But I gave him the motor. Oh, no, no. What he fails to tell everybody is that I borrowed the gearbox because he told me the motor didn't work. It didn't. And then I got hold of it and then I made it work. If it wasn't for me, his half winch my, wouldn't be working. Half my stuff wouldn't work. Well, and then that's what's having kids are for. Yeah, I suppose that's what we're here for. Yeah. Right, are we going to get it dirty? Let's get it dirty. Ladies and gentlemen, I can hear the apprehension in G-Dog's voice. Are you confident about this, G-Dog? Oh, G-Dog! Yeah? Are you... He's very apprehensive about I'm getting. Find me little handset. Are you getting? Are you a little nervous? Nah, it's what we do. Okay. He's gonna take Big Bertha through the goo. I've got to turn it on first. Oh, okay. <laughs> Dramatic build-up. Yeah, that was okay. Oh no, Emmy Winch. Oh, I wouldn't have that dangling around. Right. Oh, he, look. oh, there's mud everywhere. <laughs> right. Three, two, one, go. Where's that slow? Oh, oh yes. that is buried oh, into the axle. Yes. <laughs> Sludge and slime and goo. That went better than the... Well, definitely doesn't get through it as quick as the older... Uh... Oh, dear. Right. <laughs> so I've got a second gear on that. I'll do second gear. Second gear? I heard it. Ready. Engage. Ready. Go. And we got nothing. <laughs> First gear. It's okay. Okay. Second gear. Second, second gear done. Just good for the roads, isn't it? Yeah, it doesn't do yeah. any talk at all. No. Which is disappointing, really. Mm hmm. But. Right. Oh, let's just have a bit of fun. Oh, channel. Oh, through that big bit. Oh, he's got stuck. Them tyres aren't good for him. Look at the... No. Right. <laughs> I can't get anywhere. You have to call the wrecker out. <laughs> G-Dog was having a bit of a nose fight. Let's see uh, Let's see if this, this is going to end disastrous. Or not do anything. But you ready? Yeah. Go. Oh, no. 
Yeah, the weight is prevailing. Yeah, G Dog oh. on the weight. Yeah. It's like I'm in real life, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Look at that. I am. I can't get any deeper, to be honest. Well, I'll tell you what. Again, that was fun. It's so much fun. Mud bogging with these things is just great. And that new 370 motor in that big gearbox. Phenomenal. Yeah, Full. that that um, that worked really well. Although I think um, it well, cooks I, the battery a little bit. Yeah, and I've got no... Uh, oh, I know he I'm may not. have broken it. <laughs> yes! I've got no, uh, I've got no go. But to be fair, I think the battery just died on me. Yeah, um, it's only a little battery. It's only a little battery, and that's packing and a lot of power. A lot of power through the mud. Through the mud. So I'm not, I'm not bothered. I'm not worried. Um, no. Big Bertha. Big Bertha had a go. She had a, a little bit better than the um, Atlas, I believe. Yeah, yeah. I've got a bit of work to do with the Atlas, but I'm yeah. going to do that over a bit of time, I think. I just like, you know, I like what we do. Yeah, it's good fun. Absolutely good fun. It wrecks uh, the course. Oh, well, you know, it just adds more... Uh, I mean, organicness to it mud bogging we're going to get our club involved in this so there's going to be a few more mud boggers they're not going to want to they're not going to want to but they are um and we've got the uh new wrecker yeah games I enjoyed as well, that. so that's all good that. fun uh, 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 apart from you dragged it home you didn't uh, tow it home i got no other choice you know i beat him so the end of this month we've got our last of our winter we have cup series which and is going to be good fun and we're doing it in the dark now that's going to even be more fun yeah although we've got plenty of work to do you've got a lot of lighting to get on with yeah yeah um and yeah forever changing forever building forever trying something new yeah and if you want us to try something new and you've got a suggestion let yeah us know. definitely whack it in the comments if there's something you want us to have a go at we're definitely not afraid of doing it no. not with these little things anyway yeah, so if this is definitely something you guys really do enjoy, then subscribe, hit the like button, hit that notification bell, and, and I'll, I'll see you next time. Well, when you're doing mud bogging, once you're finished, you've got to get the cleaning done. Okay, hydro powered. <laughs> <laughs>